Hi, I am Siddhant Ora and I am here to present our open source toolkit, ESP.NET SLU, which is designed for the quick development of spoken language understanding systems. As automatic speech recognition systems are getting better, there is an increasing interest of using the ASR output to perform downstream natural language processing tasks. Spoken language understanding is the task of inferring the semantic meaning of spoken utterances. Spoken language understanding consists of two subtasks. The first subtask converts speech representation to words, and the second subtask extracts the intent of the spoken utterance. Spoken language understanding is an essential component of many daily applications like voice assistants, social bots, and intelligent home devices. It comprises widespread applications of semantic understanding from spoken utterances. Some examples include recognizing the intent and the associated entities of a user's command to take the appropriate action, understanding the emotion behind a particular utterance, or engaging in a conversation with the user by modeling the topic of the conversation. However, there are few open source toolkits that can be used to generate reproducible results on different spoken language understanding benchmarks. With the increase in data sets and methodologies proposed, there's a growing need for an open source SLU toolkit, which would help standardize the pipelines involved in building a model like data preparation, model training, and evaluation. Researchers should be able to use this toolkit to easily incorporate previous proposed technologies, compare and contrast new ideas with existing methodologies. It should further support other speech processing steps that need to be applied before running the downstream task. ESP.NET SLU is a new end-to-end -end spoken language understanding toolkit built on an already existing open source speech processing toolkit, ESP.NET. We provide a pipeline that cover all the experimental processes of building an SLU model for intent classification, slot filling, emotion recognition, and dialogue at classification datasets. This toolkit incorporates the use of pre-trained ASR models like Hubert Wave2x and pre-trained NLU models like BERT MPNet that can be used as feature extractors for the ASR and NLU submodules inside the uh, SLU framework. ESPNet also supports a variety of speech processing tasks that can be used in a pipeline manner, thus replicating real-world scenarios where speech processing front-end needs to be applied before performing a downstream task. We further release an open source toolkit and provide easy access to the trained models that match or even significantly outperform the state-of-the-art performance on these benchmarks. ESPNet also provides easy access to other speech technologies being developed, like data augmentation, encoder subsampling, speech-focused encoders like conformers, and a variety of decoders. Multitask learning-based approaches have become popular to stent the training of the SLU systems. Hence, we allowed the option to add auxiliary ASR objectives by making the model generate both intent and transcript. We experimented with multitasking with ASR transcripts on the fluent speech command dataset, gaining further improvements in SLU performance on this dataset. Recent work has advanced the state-of-the-art SLU performance by building the architecture on self-supervised ASR and NLU models. Inspired by this work, we also support options to use pre-trained ASR and NLU models as feature extractors. We use the STPR and FairSec toolkit to access a variety of self-supervised learning representations as speech processing front-ends in our SLU architecture. 
We further integrate the Hugging Face Transformers library, which allows usage of numerous generic and task-specific pre-trained NLU models. For the slurp data set, we also analyzed using different pre-trained ASR systems as feature extractors and observe that they do not give improved performance over the FPAN features. We observe that a mass reconstruction-based pre-trained ASR system, Terra, performs the best, whereas autoregressive reconstruction-based pre-trained ASR system, BQAPC, performs worst among different pre-trained ASR systems. We also analyzed the impact of pre-trained NLU systems to incorporate semantic information. The analysis showed that researchers can use our toolkit to compare the utility of different pre-trained ASR and NLU systems as feature extractors. The toolkit also contains recipe for languages such as Japanese, Dutch, Tamil, Sinhara, and Mandarin. With these recipes, we want to facilitate research in SLU technologies and ensure that they are available to a wide variety of users going beyond English speaking users. Human interactions are usually in the form of spoken conversation where the semantic meaning of a given utterance depends on the context in which it is spoken. Hence, we support using dialogue history to perform classification on each conversation turn. The given slide shows the results for dialogue act classification task on the switchboard corpus. In dialogue act classification task, the system has to classify a given utterance to one of the dialogue act classes, such as statement, questions, etc. Since it has been reported that context is important for dialogue act classification, we also extend each utterance by simple concatenation with the acoustic signal from three preceding utterances to provide context, which improves the accuracy by 2%. ESPNet supports various speech processing tasks such as speech recognition, speech translation, and speech enhancement. We believe that to perform downstream understanding tasks on real-world audios, these tasks need to be applied in conjunction with the downstream SLU task. By having multiple tasks in a single unified implementation, ESPNet allows the usage of different speech tasks in a pipeline manner that can have widespread applications. We test our hypothesis on the Fluent Speech Command dataset. We first convert the audio files into noisy speech by adding real-world noise. We compute the intent classification performance using our already trained model on clean audio files and observe a significant drop in performance as shown on the red line. The noise files were then passed to a speech enhancement model trained on the KIME 4 dataset. We observe a significant improvement in the intent classification performance on these enhanced audio files, highlighting the advantage of having multiple tasks in a unified toolkit. In the given slide, we show the supported task and datasets in ESPNet SLU, along with their reported performance in the original paper and our toolkit. ESPNet SLU contains recipe for over 10 diverse spoken language understanding corpora, encompassing multiple languages and multiple task types, with performance nearing or exceeding the prior state of the art. We release an open source toolkit and provide access to our trained models with the objective of facilitating fast research and development of SLU systems through standardized recipes for various benchmarks. Thanks a lot for watching. We look forward to hearing your questions in the poster session.